So here's a scenario. You've got a Windows 7 computer and after Windows updates, you get stuck at this screen configuring Windows updates, 35% complete, do not turn off your computer. And it sits here and it sits here and it never moves. It may not necessarily be 35%, it could be 98%, could be 50%, could be a different, any kind of number, but usually 35 is, is where a lot of these get stuck. So if that's your problem, stick around and I'm gonna show you how to fix it. So the very first thing you wanna do is power off your computer. Just press and hold the power button until you hear the machine turn off. And then you wanna go ahead and power your computer back on. And when the manufacturer screen loads, you wanna tap the F8 key at the top of your keyboard until you get this menu it says advanced boot options then you want to scroll down to the very first option which is safe mode don't choose safe mode with networking choose regular safe mode and then hit enter and then you're going to see all these lines that pop up on your screen just like this don't worry it's nothing to freak out about this is what happens when you load windows in the background you just don't see it these are all the different windows system components that are loading then it's going to come back to the screen and you're going to see the same configuring windows updates 35 percent complete what you want to do is leave it here now it may take five minutes it may take 30 minutes it could take five hours but eventually windows will either complete the updates and continue into safe mode or it will blue screen on you one of those two things is almost always going to happen if that's the case leave your computer here be patient go do something else and when it finally loads i'll show you what to do to keep this from happening again so after about an hour and 15 minutes windows finally loaded which means whatever windows needed to do to figure out what it needed to do it figured it out so the next thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to disable the windows update service in safe mode go to your start menu go to run and type in services.msc and hit enter. It's gonna bring up your Windows Services Manager. Scroll all the way down to Windows Update. Double click on it. Change it from automatic to manual. Then click apply and okay. Close that window. And the next thing you wanna do is we want to go and delete all the downloaded Windows Update files. So from your start menu, click on computer. And then on computer, you want to go find your C drive, right click on it and go to properties. The very first window that comes up right here, click on disk cleanup. What this does is it goes and finds all the files that can be safely deleted because we've already turned off the Windows Update service. Now we want to delete all the Windows Update files. So when the computer restarts, it doesn't even think that there's updates to install. So this will take a few minutes, so just be patient. Okay, once that disk cleanup check is run you'll see a box that pops up like this there will be a bunch of different individual items you'll see a windows update files listed in here check on all of these boxes click ok and say yes delete files windows will take a couple minutes and go through and delete all of these temporary files and then once you're done click ok and then just simply go start shut down restart the computer and just like that, as you can see, once you go through and follow these steps and delete those temporary files, your Windows desktop loads properly and you are back in Windows. And that's all you got to do if you get stuck doing the Windows update in Windows 7. I hope this video helped you. If it did, take a second to like and subscribe my channel so you get more great videos like this. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day.